Hello and uh, assalamu alaikum to everyone. Um, in last day, uh, in last uh, uh, tutorial, we had uh, designed uh, an equivalent circuit, an equivalent circuit of an uh, antenna. This is an equivalent circuit model of a micro strip antenna. So, what is micro strip antenna? Here, here you can see uh, this is a micro strip antenna. In this figure, you can also see these are multiple shapes micro strip antenna. So, this is a micro strip antenna. So, this is actually a page which uh, result in uh, resonance, which uh, create electromagnetic radiation. E R, uh, it converts uh, electrical signal into electromagnetic signal in transmission mode and uh, receive electromagnetic uh, radiation in uh, reception mode and convert uh, it to uh, electrical signal. So the actually this is a, a, a microstrip patch antenna and this is a peat line and uh, this is a dielectric material and uh, this is a ground plane. So uh, I uh, had I have told you in the previous uh, uh, tutorial uh, that uh, this is a micro strip patch antenna. This is a peat line. This is a uh, guide for our any electrical source, and this is a, a terminator. So if you see this portion is actually represent a whole antenna which exists on here this is a our whole antenna okay now if you see uh, in this equivalent circuit so we have uh, inductor capacitor uh, here also is a inductor and a capacitor so what this inductor capacitor actually represents in this circle uh, are what what actually they are representing the uh, equivalence uh, what they I mean what they are actually representing uh, to the uh, and how it is representing to uh, this antenna. So if you see uh, this is a ground plant and it is also a conductor and uh, here is uh, also a conductor so wind current fast uh, wind current fast from a conductor so due to the motion of electron electromagnetic field creates around it and uh, when electromagnetic field creates uh, so by default uh, inductance is also create over there so actually uh, this inductor, uh, this inductor uh, represent this portion of uh, electrical um, antenna, and uh, this uh, this inductor represents this portion, this portion of a peat line. Now let's come to capacitors. Why this capacitors exists over here and uh, or uh, and it over here too so its answer is that when electron uh, with AC current falls from over here so uh, here a uh, electric field creates between these two con conductors so that reason in the form uh, of uh, capacitor over here and here too so due to uh, the electric field over here a capacitance actually exists in this so uh, RLC circuit so um, this capacitance is due to uh, capacitance over here and uh, this uh, capacitance is uh, due to uh, capacitance due to electric field over here uh, I mean between the patch and uh, a ground plane so that's why we have a uh, okay, RLC uh, uh, inductor capacitor, uh, so capacitor inductor circuit over here and uh, 
inductor and capacitor or circuit over here uh, too. So, uh, so you have now uh, actually now you have considered how and why capacitor and inductor or circuit or exists over here. So now let's come to change the uh, actual topic which we had left in the previous video we want to discuss uh, we uh, we want to discuss uh, to change uh, uh, the resonance frequency from 7.4 or uh, 7.5 to uh, 10 or 5 gigahertz so for that purpose uh, we will need to change uh, the value of uh, uh, inductor or capacitor so let's begin from uh, inductor so I am changing its value from uh, uh, okay let's uh, let's remember one point if you want to increase capacitor or uh, if you want to increase resonance frequency you will need to decrease uh, uh, the value of inductors uh, over uh, here and here too and if you want to in, if decrease the value of uh, resonance frequency you will need to increase the value of uh, inductor either the value of inductor or capacitor so it's up to you uh, I go with the uh, inductor and I want to decrease the resonance frequency so I'm selecting 1.2 and uh, inductor value I also want to change it to 1.2 so if I will compile our simulation